welcome back to my channel this video is based on what's in my purse video and you guys this is one of my coach purses i will be doing a video on all of my coach collections soon as when i get my coach purses delivered from coach outlet you guys i will do my coach collection so please be subscribed and make sure you turn on your notification because this is going to be a budget friendly coach collection video once i make it and i will definitely let you guys know i don't know when it's going to be out because clearly my delivery still say standard which is sucks so much you guys but right now i am going to do what's in my coach purse video i know you've never seen this video before but um i love this purse it's a coach purse and um it has a zipper on the outside and a, you know the pocket is really kind of deep and then on the front it doesn't have anything and then of course the inside looks just like that so let's get started into this video so first thing first thing i i took out my purse um is my today will be amazing book from dollar general it's all scratched up you guys because it's old um and in this book is talking about my god knows everything um i write when i read my bible um and i put my notes in here i like this book because it's nice and small and i could just straight fit into my purse just like that real simple real easy let me tell you guys i got this purse from um bertrand well actually my fiance got it for me but i got it i got this purse from bertrand at the coach store but i'm pretty sure they have this coach purse at the outlet and this purse was i think like probably like 120 130 of course my coach wallet it looks just like that and it has a zipper on the outside so you can put your change in here but of course y'all see i have a couple dollars let me count because i let me see y'all i got this one from cvs and the lady just gave me a bunch of ones okay so i just got like not that much just two fives and a couple dollars in that one little pocket i don't keep my change in there because i have a change wallet and then once you open it up my id <laughs> Of course, my driver's license and then my cards right here. And then on the other side, I also have compartments you can put your cards. I don't carry all of my credit cards on me because I don't feel as though I need to. So I, I only got uh, my credit card of Home Depot. This is Home Depot. This is Costco's. And this is my debit card from um, Michigan First. So yeah, I have a lot of credit cards but i don't need them because they i have credit cards in like different areas like davis bridles stuff like that um and i don't put my um capital one in there either because i'm not trying to overdo that balance so and this wallet it has like a pocket right here and right here got my um my bank information right here and then in this pocket down here it has like my my extra strength um, gas X so I only have one which I need another one because sometimes when I eat food like it my stomach hurts so freaking bad and it will cramp up so bad so I need my gas X I never even thought that was going to be a lifetime thing that I'm going to be using after when I had my kids at the c-section but hey it's cool no big deal so yeah so that's what's in both of those and then of course you have another pocket right here where you can put your dollars in but i don't use that so this wallet is really really worth it i don't know how much this wallet was uh because my fiance bought it for me and you guys yeah he found money so he bought me more purses couldn't believe it and my zipper wallet right here um is of course a pad you guys this is a number four this is like one of them overnight boys so i'm gonna open it up for you ladies to see if you don't if you never use one of these but yeah this is my overnight i don't it's my overnight pad i don't use it for overnights even though it lasts for 10 hours but 
we all know we cannot trust that <laughs> that's just an estimate but yeah i only have one pad right now because i supposed to be coming on very soon so yeah i have another coach wallet and it looks just like this and i turned this one into it's like a wristlet you could put your your wrist on it and carry it like this as a purse as well which is really really cute but i just got my change in here it's more convenient for my change because i don't have to worry about something being stiff and then i gotta like close it up and have a hard time closing it up because it's too full or whatever i needed something that's very like nice size and loose where i can put my change in so in here is a dollar oh y'all hold on a dollar and some coins and then you can also have your debit cards up here as well got two pockets and then a whole big opening for your coins so yep this is my change wallet and the inside of the wallet is pink as well and I know y'all seen this book plenty of multiple times in my was in my purse video I love this book I have not been using this book lately because I've been just trying to like remember my bills on top of my head um when i didn't run them up that that much <laughs> but yeah it's just mainly same old same old um notes bills you know same old same old i try to use it as much as possible but this book is just old it's from last year like and i now got it from like a dollar tree um what's a dollar tree or family dollar it was either the i think it was a dollar tree and they had different colors they had this one they had the red one they had the gold one and it was like around christmas time so yeah, it's like a year old, you guys. I just need to just toss it. But me, I'm trying to use up as many pages as I can in this book. But y'all, this book got to go, don't it? I, yeah, I think it got to go. Of course, I, I had one shopping today for, um, for the kids, for um, more Christmas shopping. So I got loose money in here, which I need to put it in this wallet as well. So let's go ahead and do that right now. And I'm going to put it in the middle compartment I don't like just stretching my money out and I ain't got to do all that I just fold it in there and put it in there um I got this um hydrating hand cream rose water by Bath and Body Works you guys this hand cream is the bomb like I like it so much like it's just it's so creamy you don't need that much just Put on your hands like that and you guys your hands will be smelling so freaking good like rose water and ivory and you guys rose water and ivory smell so good it's like a floral scent but more like a perfume scent it's very light oh my goodness you guys i love this hand cream i got this when it was um 2.95 sale i end up getting this cream and then i got the a thousand wishes um antibacteria hand spray like hand sanitizer from bath and body works they don't have these anymore at macomb i don't know why i don't know they i think they only just did a little bit of these and that was it but yeah this lasts me for a long time i had one in the car the one in the car is pretty much empty so yeah it's a thousand wishes it smells just like a thousand wishes like it works your hand smells so freaking good and y'all i love it and then i have multiple lip glosses in here of course from bath and body works it's a menthol lip tint and it looks just like this um it's in a plum mint and it's it tastes so good it smells so good you guys and of course my lips are popping okay but i love it i put this on to be honest just to eat it that's why i put it on so i put it on at work I try to put it on as much possible, you guys, so I can just eat it, okay? Because this will get me through the day. I need some sweet essential gum, so I just had this on my lips. And I just, you know, lick every now and then as I'm working. And then I just, you know, I enjoy it. By the time I look up, my lips be dry. I don't got nothing on my lips. Terrible, right? I know. So this other favorite lip balm is called My Favorite Night Balm. And it's eight hours overnight recovery and it looks just like this you guys i am almost out and i got this from bath and body works as well and yeah so i like this a lot it's not really that much in there as you can see i've been using it like crazy 
but with my by me having a mask on them that can't really put that much on there because it starts sticking to the mask and I don't want that so that's another lip gloss and then I just want to try something new this is the menthol lip balm stick and it's 100% um, natural mint and it's from Bath and Body Works but you guys I just by this being white I you know I think I have to put it on first and then put one of them little glossy things on because this will turn my lips white and I don't like that because it's very thick very thick so it's not like that lip balm you could just smoothly put on there no this is the lip balm that you have to like rub your lips like you know what I'm saying how your lips be going like this when you put it on this does the trick but it feels so good on your lips it makes your lips soft I was surprised that my lips didn't break out from this because my lips cannot take every kind of lip gloss or every kind of lipstick or lip balm because my lips will break out from the ingredients that they use but I was so grateful my lips did not break out from this so I got this little chapstick from Bath and Body Works and yeah it works but you'll have to put a lip balm over it to make sure your lips not white okay and then I got two pens I got a regular pen and I also got a gel pen in the purple so when I write my notes and my golly book I can highlight it with that but I end up um ordering me a whole new bible that's why you don't see my bible in my purse because my other bible is just towed up to the flow it's not on the bed nowhere you guys i can't find it so you know and then of course i got my 11 inch millimeter uh job tool that i bought for myself and it's my wrench i think that's they call it a wrench or whatever i don't know but i decided to use my own because I don't want to use somebody else's stuff and I ain't got a time for them to be like, oh, you're responsible for my for my stuff. I bought from home and you can't find it where you got to replace mine. So, nope, I bought my own. So, yep, I keep this in my purse everywhere with me because I need this for work. And then I got a purple highlighter. As you can see, purple is my favorite color. And this was for my book that I was reading. Um, damn, my book not up here either. Okay. So, yeah, I used this for the book that I was reading. But I'm kind of trying to take a break from that book. It's a good book, but you know, it's one of them, them interesting drama books. You're like, hmm, but I'm trying to clear my mind and get my mind more on God than just reading those books. So I haven't, I kind of took a break on those books. I, I bought them, but I am going to read them. But I just been kind of take a break because I've been trying to read into more into God more. And I got my scrunchie, of course, for my hair. Y'all, it's Sunday, Sunday night, and I got to go to work tomorrow. So I need to do my hair tonight and get it ready for Christmas. So don't mind my hair. But yeah, I have to do that before bed. As much as I don't want to do it, I might end up doing my hair tomorrow. Um, I got a lighter. No, I do not smoke. No, I don't need it. I just need it to light my candles. And when I can't find one, at least I know one is in my purse. I don't never carry lighters. I just started carrying a lighter just to throw it in there because just in case if I can't find a lighter anywhere, I know I got one in my purse to lit a candle. And then, of course, I have another all-purpose lip balm, and it is innocent rose and this one came from bath and body works and yeah i like this one this i tried this one out today it's very like it's very like light so i don't know if you can see that so it's it's not really a lot you see it's very little so it's it's like a it's like a bomb you know it's not menthol it's just regular it don't taste good it's just a regular lip balm <laughs> I'll be honest so I thought it tastes good I wish it did taste good so I could eat it more but what I would do is I would use this and this together perfect match no big deal and then I also bought this lemon lip balm 100 natural lemon and I like this this reminds me of the um, Vaseline lip balm that you get from Dollar Tree or Walgreens for a dollar and you guys, I like it a lot because I put it on at night, I lick it a little bit, and it tastes so good, and it smells like lemon. But this is one of the ones that I have not opened up, but I got me a couple of them, and I got this for the $2.95 sale. And that's what I really go to the $2.95 sale is for my lip balm, because I got everything else. And of course, I got my Mary Mango hand sanitizer, you guys. They got the Santa Claus. I got this from SIS sale, so, like, this summer. So yeah, I stocked up on a lot of that, a lot of these. Um, I got a video on my page if you haven't seen that. Um, it is on there. And then I have some loose coins, which need to be in my coach wallet, you guys. Oh my goodness. 
So at least my purse ain't that messy. I'm so surprised, which I just did my purse not too long ago. And then my mirror, of course, everybody know what my mirror looks like. Y'all, it's old, so don't mind that it looks raggedy. And then don't even close anymore. It is, I don't care. I ain't even gonna buy me a new one. It works just fine. The mirror ain't cracked. That's all that matters. And then in this pocket right here, I think I have just some some paper. Nothing on it. Um, I just did that today. So, yeah. That is it, you guys. This purse is very freaking roomy. Look how deep it is. It is so deep. Oh, my goodness, you guys. So, um, I'm going to show you everything, how I put everything in my purse. So, I put my pad in the zipper thing and I zip that up. So that way I ain't gotta open up my purse and people like all in my business. So at least it's hidden. And then I just stuff stuff in there. Just put stuff in there. Oh, yeah, my, my dime came out. So I just put stuff in there. Just put it on in there. But I'm trying to make sure you guys can see. Just put it on in there. So you can see how big this purse is and how it can fit everything my purse is a little heavy but it's not too heavy because it has light stuff in it the only thing makes it heavy i think is my book so yeah in my wallet of change so that is it for my purse video i hope you guys like this video if you do please subscribe please comment or please like i would like that a lot thank you guys for watching Make sure you guys have a wonderful night. Bye.